the European Super Cup, yeah, next week, and the uh, the World Club Cup. When you talk about it, just then you sounded a bit, let's say, annoyed that you're playing in these competitions because it's extra games. Are you? Would you rather not play them? I love it. I love it to play Super Cup, European Super Cup, and 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 even the Community Shield. Even uh, first, because we as a club, we never won it. This club never won the European Super Cup, and of course, to win. To play the World Cup, you have to win the Champions League. So, win the Champions League give you this opportunity. It's, it's a pleasure to go to Athens and 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 play there. Absolutely not. I love it. I love it. We like it. Okay. We like. It. And just talking about, I think you talked about this, and players definitely have about this this season about maybe games going to 100 minutes. Um, isn't that only happening because players and managers time waste during games to sort of try and save the result? And so what? Therefore, it's actually down to the players and managers themselves that they haven't extended the games. And if you think about it logically, does this then mean that 100-minute games are going to be time wasted, and then they have to go to 110 minutes? And so the actual issue is kind of with great people like yourself and the players who, who have sort of caused this. I talk about my team. We are not a team like I'm not saying that the last one or two minutes left where we win two one one zero. I'm going to the corner to Bernardo keep the ball to waste the time. I'm going to do it, but I'm not thinking it's a team like we're going to waste time for my career. That's the point. If you want to control it, make it like basketball. Stop the stop the work. Why eight minutes last game and not twelve? Or on four? I don't know exactly what happened. It was one goal. And it was a four or five substitutions. It was not injured, like the first half. Or the guard was down. Uh, I don't know. What eight minutes? Ten minutes? It's okay. We're going to play eight ten minutes. It's the same like I said before. So they decide ten minutes. Ten minutes. We're going to do it. So, but if you want it, make out top. Yeah, because in this ten minutes and, and ten minutes you're going to waste time too. So it's natural way. It's not it's not the issue. But uh, it's the same when the Premier League decide that for the World Cup or for the international. I don't know who's the reason why if they want to do it and play every game 100 games or 100 sorry 100 minutes or 105 minutes or 110 minutes. So we're going to play 105 minutes, 110 minutes. What can we do? So now I have to use it. You said, oh guys, when in 90 minutes, you have to know mentally that still you have 10 minutes. In 90 minutes, you can you have to keep going playing. You have to still playing. You have to attacking or defending better. It depends on the circumstances, you know? But of course, for the teams, like play every three days in competition, even competitions travel and extend. Because at the end, with 10 minutes, 10 minutes, 10 minutes, every game is like you are going to play three more games at the end of the season. We are going to play 41 games this season, not 38. 41, that's for sure. So when it's a lot with all of the games, because I said many times, our players, I defend my players, when I go to international break, they go to the national team and they play 100 minutes, 100 minutes. And uh, and I said, okay, you play 50, 60, 70 games, it's okay, but after you have two months off, or have three months off, or you have time to recover mentally, but it's not the case. We have just two, three weeks, and it's not enough for that. And next season, World Cup, is two more weeks. Finish the season, the Champions League final or FA Cup final is two more weeks in the United States of America to play there. The finish, I would say, maybe mid of July. The five August is play the Community Shield, the first game of the season. How are you going to rest to the players? And for that, we have to do it. have to be 40 players. And the 40 players is sustainable for the clubs because the salaries are so high. And <laughs> it's impossible to, in the long term, to, to do it. Because it's, what, what is the society? I think so. No, is it's more time, it's more quantity, quantity, more minutes, more everything. No, I have to be the opposite. Make 30 minutes and 30 minutes and extend 10 minutes, the, go to the quality. Otherwise, the players at the end will be will be difficult. But for them, it doesn't matter. But for them, the players are numbers. They are treated as numbers. If it's not a player, will be another one. If it's not this player, will be another one. If it's not this manager, will be another one. What is the problem? It doesn't matter, and they and they are more, and the players need, and everyone needs, you know. The people need to go to the theater, the cinema, to go to the parks, to go to the gardens, to do other things that all the time football, football. And when they arrive, be be nice, you know. But 
is not going to change. That's for sure because it's getting worse. You know, we start that more games, more games, and and more on that. Yeah. Um, <coughs> when Manchester United completed the treble, um, they've said since that they felt the standards dropped the following season because of the intensity <coughs> of what they've achieved and uh, and the effort it took. Do you think it's inevitable that that? It's a good question. I didn't. I didn't what, what happened? I didn't. Uh, when Manchester United won the treble the following season, what happened? They Finish? felt that their standards dropped a bit uh, yeah. because of the intensity of what. Even though they won the title again, because of the intensity of what they've gone through, is but that inevitable? But won the title. Yeah, but yeah. what was? Yeah, they still won the title, but they felt that o overall. <laughs> <laughs> no, they've said that. Yeah, it's inevitable. Yeah, a little bit, a little bit. Yeah, we try to avoid, uh, you know, as much as possible, but uh, yeah, it's inevitable. So what else we can do better, you know? We won the quadruple uh, years ago, now we're the trouble in Europe, so yeah, what else? You have the European Cup, we didn't win it before, we have the Saudi Arabia World Cup, we didn't win it before, but what else? So it's not, the motivation is not the, the targets, the Premier Leagues or this kind of things, it's, okay, Barley, we can do in football-wise or in the way we play, do it something, you know, do it better uh, individually. But in terms of that, it's difficult to find right now when it's 11 months to leave the trophies. When we have a two or three months left to win, leave the trophies possible challenge after, okay, we can talk about that. But now, big mistake thinking about trophies and titles. Big mistake after we have done that to do in specific football, what you have to do to win, to win tomorrow, no, 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 there, because we're on five, you know. And another one, yeah, would be nice. Yeah, that's good, but nothing changed much. It's the way we played, you know, and and take the motivation individually to enjoy playing football, to enjoy being here in everywhere, to prove ourselves. And if we are able to maintain the level and close to the other contenders to to arrive until the end, I have to fight like we have done all the time. Hi, Pep. At the start, you said um, that it feels like last season ended just yesterday. How have you been able to kind of switch off this summer? And do you get the sense that the players have kind of been able to switch off? And Many players ask me, give me more days, Pep. Give me more days off to come back later. I said, I can't. <laughs> I have to go to Asia to prepare a little bit for the club needs, you know, to pay our salaries. You yourself, and after you we have a community shield ready, so we have to come back earlier. So it's normal. It was so demanding last season. <laughs> so demanding. Arrive when we arrive was, <laughs> you know, one more game would not be possible. So and now after two three weeks we are here again, we start again. You know, and it's not not much. But the players went to the national teams after well, you know went to the play to the to the national teams. They said, ah, yeah, but not just you. All the other players. Yeah, but the other players they had two weeks off. You know before so it's a lot it's a lot but we had that feeling but you have to recharge ourselves to challenge ourselves and and behave i don't have any doubts in the case because what i saw against arsenal and the training sessions every day even the games in in asia it was really good really really good but i don't know how much will sustain you know for 11 months this situation i don't know i don't know because i've been before in barcelona about a long time ago and but the Spanish league is not so demanding like is this one, and and I don't know what's going to happen. You also said that you told the players to forget about last year, about the achievements um, that you did. How important is that for them to kind of move on? And no, and no, I I don't want they forget what they achieve. I said the previous conference before coming to Chile, I don't want they forget what they achieve. Why should do it? They have to know. We have to. We were there, up, up there, now hope down, and start again is uh, do it, yeah. When we arrive here, the, the sense it was completely different to build something, to create something. I wasn't expected to do five Premier Leagues in seven years, honestly. And the people said, ah, but without the Champions League, we will not be enough. Okay, now we have it. What's next? So what's next is Burley, Bini, what they do, what they have to try to here, one hour away to do and after enjoy all the group with the people enjoy this Europe event for the Super Cup and yeah and no more than that. I'm not going to promise you never done it, but thinking oh I have to win the Premier League or no no it's far far 
It's too far. Many things is going to happen. Many things in 11 months. Not just city. All, all the clubs will be up and down. And just to see after, like your colleague said, and a bit of all, maybe we'll fall down. Not too much. Not too much. We're going to drop, that's for sure. That's for sure. It's not drop too much to stay there, stay there, stay there. Close to the, our rivals that I had the feeling will be up front of us. Be in there, be in there. And try to, at the last four, five, six months, okay, let's do what we have done every single season. And the moment we should do it, we did it. And and I don't want to do it now. Now it's not drop much. This is my feeling. Time for two more guys. One for me and one for Mike, please. Hi, hi Pep. Um, a lot of your players, when they come here, they show a, a sort of improvement in the second season, it, like it almost takes them a year to get used to, to the way you do things. Obviously, in the case of Erling Haaland, it would be difficult for him to score more goals. Yeah. But are you looking for improvements? Do you expect improvements in other areas? And, and if so, what areas of his game do you see improvements coming? No, I would say that Erling did, that didn't need the second season. Uh, need maybe one community shield game to realize, no more than that. Uh, I, I will advise him, don't put too much pressure and market about the goals and so on. So, when I would say to Erling, come back at your best, because he's one meter 90, I don't know how tall he is. And try to, you know, your best, physical, mentally. Uh, if you score fine, if you don't score fine, uh, Try to improve in your details, you know, in your quality, in the skills, in the in the spaces like you can be a better player. And if the team is going to help you, to give you as much chance as possible to score a goal. This is what you have to, to do. I don't want Erling to score 50 or 60. So try to be happy it was last season. Relax and try to get back your best. After holidays, after Asia, still needs a little bit of time. So every train, training better, every game you play, play, you know, demanding yourself to make the efforts. And after the goals, as he knows, will come along. Will come naturally. Don't force it. But we have to do, you know, we have to do something, him and everyone, to the situation happen. We cannot wait, okay, like we won, it's going, no, no, no. We have to do something. We have to do something to to the chances, to defend well, to score goals, to not concede, to save, sit pieces. We have to do something to make it happen. Last one with Mike, Pep, the new regulations uh, from the referees on managers. Mikel got a uh, yellow card, maybe for not very much, last week. Um, do you think it's inevitable you'll, be, you'll, you'll receive a red card at some point? This, this Me? This, yeah. We, we, this. <laughs> This is my, my, the only title I don't have here in England. <laughs> <laughs> it's the only one. Listen, I understand the referees, but sometimes, sometimes we behave really, really bad in front of the fourth official, the referees. So, and I had the feeling always that when we review after, pff, we, will sh we feel ashamed. And, and the other side is, uh, is, uh, uh, I, mm, we have to control it, but the emotions is there, and if we cannot celebrate, or we can actually say, "Yeah, what happened?" And it will be so annoying, you know. You've been there like this all the time without nothing, anything. Is no nice either. I remember the first season. Maybe you remember the first season when I arrived. It was a rule the referees that every single touch is penalty. I remember the first game away in Stock City, there, like uh, Mark Hughes was there, my colleague. And it was a two penalties, like it, penalty. And after a month or two months, it changed. You know, now I understand that that uh, it's some sensitive. We behave most of the time really bad in confront, and we have to improve that. But at the end, hopefully, we can find the balance. You know, as much you make something and not over the judge already, the people you know can can behave. But now we know. Now I know every time we're going to talk will be yellow card and every moment that will be yellow card. Now we know it. So we have to adapt and accept the consequences and hopefully at the end we can arrive at a moment that we can talk with the referees, the referees can talk with us, we can talk with four officials, or officials can talk with us in, in the normal way.